With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello friends, so here is a question. It says that a 20 meter high vertical pole and a vertical tower are on the same level ground in such a way that the angle of elevation on the top of the tower as seen from the foot of the pole is 60 degree and the angle of elevation of the top of the pole as seen from the foot of the tower is 30 degree find the height of the tower okay so let me first draw the diagram for you okay so in this question we have a tower and a pole right so and it is given that they are in the same level ground right so let this be our pole right now in this question we have the height of the pole given to us as 20 meters right and it is said that from the foot of the pole, the angle of elevation for the tower is 60 degree, right? That means this angle is given to us as 60 degree. Similarly, it is said that the angle of elevation for the pole from the foot of the tower is equal to 30 degree, right? So this angle will be 30 degree. And then we have to find out the height of the tower, okay? So let this height be h, right? So we have to find out the value of h in this question okay now let me name these points let this be a b and this be c d right and let this distance b d be equal to x okay so now in triangle a b d i can see that 10 of 60 degree is equal to h upon x right tan of 60 degree will be equal to this a b divided by b d right a b divided by b d sorry b d and we have the let me write this again this is b d right and we have a b as h meters and b d as x meters right so 10 of 60 will become h upon x right or i can write 10 of 60 degree as root 3 right because the value of 10 of 60 degree is equal to square root of 3 so that will be equal to h upon x right so from here the value of x is equal to h upon root 3 right so this is the first thing okay now in triangle b c d i can write that in triangle b c d we have 10 of 30 degree is equal to 20 upon x right so this will become 20 divided by x right you can see that 10 of 30 degree is actually equal to CD divided by BD, right? So CD divided by BD and we have CD as 20 meter and BD as X meters, right? So from here, we have the values. Now, if I put the value of 10 of 30 degree, that is equal to 1 by square root of root 3, that is equal to 20 divided by X, right? So from here, I have the value of X is 20 root 3, right? So we got the value of x as 20 root 3. Let's put this value here, right? So let I'm putting this value of x in this equation. So we have 20 square root of 3 is equal to h by root 3, right? So from here we have h equals to 20 square root of 3 into square root of 3, right? So finally we have the value of h as 20 into 3 that is equal to 60 meters, right? So this will be our answer that is the height of the tower. A, B is actually equal to 60 meters right so this will be our answer i hope this will help you thank you for class 6 to 12 itg and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today